Hello YouTube and welcome to Weekends with What the Math. Today I wanted to do three things. I wanted to answer some questions and also talk about some cool facts, cool things and cool news. And also I wanted to do some shout outs to a few of you because why not? So the first question is, why is this channel called What the Math? Well, two reasons really. One is that I do teach math and there's a lot of math videos you'll find on this channel. And two is that math, the word math in Greek actually means something that is learned. And this is what this channel is about. It's a channel for all of you polymaths, people that like to learn everything. And a lot of the videos here will be based on that. They will teach you a little bit of everything using video games. All right, let's talk about some cool things now. And one of those cool things is that I just started a Universe Sandbox 2 discussion group on Facebook. And the link for this group is in the description below. Also, there has been a lot of really cool things about the moon in the news this week. And one of those cool things is that a team called Space IL from Israel may actually win the $20 million X prize from Google for landing the first thingy on the moon. Uh, it has to be homemade or basically has to be a small team that made the actual lander and they may launch it in 2017 but they've said they already prepared everything everything is ready to go and they might be the, f the winners we'll find out in 2017 but it's actually pretty awesome all right well that's cool but what does it have to do with you well there's actually a kickstarter for yet another lander where you can actually become a part of the history basically you can join in pay a little bit of money to help them build the, the lander and this is a completely different team actually and this team will even give you a little bit of hard drive space to add something to the lander so you can become part of history and send a piece of yourself to the moon well no not the real piece just the digital piece maybe like a picture or something check out the link if you want to join it's a kickstarter thingy and it's not very expensive also, are you a Moonlander denier? Do you think it was a fake? Well, if you are, you may want to close this video because here is a link for all of the awesome pictures that Apollo mission took on the way to the moon, on the moon, and then on the way back from the moon. Basically, it's unedited. These are all the, absolutely all of the pictures they've taken, and some of them are pretty awesome. You should check them out. Some of them are gorgeous, beautiful, and it does give you an idea of how long the trip was because there is a lot of pictures in that folder. So thank you, NASA, for providing those awesome pictures. The link for those pictures is obviously in the description below. And speaking of pictures, here's another one from NASA, and this one is of Pluto, yet another picture of Pluto. What you see here is Pluto, there's a sun in the background, and it's creating this really awesome haze, or sort of like a halo, uh, based on the reflection of, from atmosphere, or not reflection, but refraction from the atmosphere. And so this gave me an idea, can we actually terraform Pluto? Is it terraformable? Can we actually do it in the Universe Sandbox 2? Stay tuned to find out, maybe tomorrow. In completely unrelated news, there's a very, very large asteroid passing by Earth right now, today or tomorrow, depending on when you're watching this. And it's actually so big that if it hits us, uh, we're kind of screwed. It's about two miles or three kilometers long. Um, it would actually destroy one of the countries that it hits and would create huge tsunamis and earthquakes. Uh, so yeah, NASA kind of just didn't tell us about it. But the thing is, it's actually, it's, uh, it's not that close. It's not gonna pass us very close. It's passing us at approximately 10% uh, of astronomical one astronomical unit which is about 15 million kilometers away from us so it's pretty far it's actually uh, several times farther than the moon but this creates uh, an opportunity for it to hit us in the future so it's actually now designated as near earth asteroid which possibly may one day hit us so stay tuned i guess Next, uh, have you seen the movie The Martian? Well, I haven't, so don't spoil, but if you have seen the movie, you may want to check out this 1964, almost a copy of that movie, uh, called Robinson Crusoe on Mars. There's a link for this movie in the description below. It's practically the same thing, except it has a monkey and an alien, and it's a lot more awesome, I think. So if you can still find this old movie, go check it out, it's pretty cool. Okay, and before we finish, let's do a few shoutouts. And also, I wanted to ask you guys to post a few questions for a Q&A video that's coming up really, really soon. So post your questions, any questions you want, I will probably answer them in a future video. But here we go, first shoutout is... And the first shoutout goes to Helix. I think this person actually posted this a few times, he wanted me to do a shoutout. So here you go, shoutout, I guess... Ah, is that good? Cool. Because I shout it and it's out, right? And number two is actually an answer to a question, not really a shout out. And this person is asking me about the Twitch stream. When is it? How is it? What is it? Uh, it's coming up soon. I am so sorry I have not settled for a final schedule yet. I've tried a few slots here and there. Uh, some of them didn't really work for me because I am a full-time teacher. And some of them didn't work for you guys because there was like one person watching and I'm like, okay, this is awkward. Let's talk about your life. And so let's, let me just few, uh, try a few more schedules. And then I think it's going to be Saturday nights. 
uh, or possibly Sunday mornings, but for you guys, it's going to be different time depending on where you live. So I'm going to post some scheduled time sometime soon and you'll find out about it because it's going to be in the banner above the channel name. So thank you so much, love one to bab for reminding me to answer this question. And lastly, Crazy Gaming asked, did I see Comic San, which is one of the fonts that some people do not like. So yes, you will no longer see Comic San. I'm switching to a different font. I'm sorry for using it. I thought it was funny. Ha ha ha. All right, this is it. Thank you guys so much for watching, for subscribing and for liking the videos. Hopefully you have some awesome questions to ask me for the next vlog that I will be answering in the next video. And meanwhile, check out some of those links I posted about the moon, about the universe and everything else. And watch that movie. That's actually pretty cool. Thank you and game you later. Bye bye.